guys, it's Kimberly and welcome back to my channel. So today, I did a Fifty Shades Darker inspired makeup look and this is the final, like this is, this is what happened, this is what goes down in this video. So if you want to know how to achieve this look, then just keep on watching, but before you do so, Make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified anytime I upload. Uh, make sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoy it and comment down anything you want. Anything. 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 So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. I said that already. I will stop talking now. Have fun. So, I already went ahead and did my eyebrows using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Medium Brown. And I'm going to prime my face now using the NYX First Base Primer Spray. So, now taking the e.l.f. eyeshadow primer in the shade Sheer, I'm going to prime my lids. I'm going to be taking the shade Foxy, which is this nude shade right here, from the Naked 2 palette to uh, set the eyeshadow primer. Now using the same palette, I'll be taking a crease brush. This is the e.l.f. crease brush. And, and I'll be taking the shade Tease, which is just a taupey color. So I'm putting that on the crease. Oh, so there's two shades in this palette called Pistol and Verve, and Pistol is like a grayish color, but it has like green in it, so I'm going to consider that one of the 50 shades of gray. <laughs> and then Verve is like a silver color, so this one's Verve, and this one's Pistol, and um... I like to take the term 50 shades of gray literally, so I'm going to put 50 shades of gray on my face. Well, not really because I don't have 50 shades of gray. I'm going to take the shade Pistol and put it on the outer corners of my crease. So basically right here. Actually, I think I'm going to go over the whole eyelid with this shade. I'm going to revamp my crease and you will get fallout like I have fallout right here so just keep that in mind so taking a cotton pad with just some micellar water I'm cleaning up the extra like the fallout from the eyeshadows so I'm going to be taking the naked naked skin weightless complete coverage concealer from urban decay in the shade light neutral I'm taking the shade medium light neutral now and putting them in between So now using a damp beauty blender, I'm going to blend this out. So we're going to set our face now with the Laura Mercier primer so that Christian doesn't think we're Mrs. Robinson. You don't want that. And I'll be using my Shade and Light palette from Kat Von D. But instead of doing what I normally do, which is dip into both of these, I'm just going to dip into this one. And it's a more cooler toned brown. Like the other ones are more on the warm side. Why I'm doing this is because gray is more of a cool toned color. <laughs> and so I want to resemble gray as much as I can. So I'm taking this palette again and I'm going with blackout which is the black right here and I'm going to put this black color 
wiping off the excess on my lower lash line. And then I'm going to take another brush to just blend it out a bit. Now I'm going to highlight the inner corners using the shade Verve from this palette. And it's just that silver, like the silverish gray color. Now we're gonna do eyeliner. You can skip this step because I think this eye look would look really nice without eyeliner. And you could just pop on some lashes if you're that type of person. If not, then you could just put on mascara. I'm not an eyelash person. I have eyelashes, but I don't like wearing them. So um, I'm just gonna use this eyeliner. When I talk to my friends, they will say to me, Boy, what's wrong with you? About that pussy. Yeah, I guess they must be right. That's why I long for you every day and night. I know you feel the same way I do. Heart is gives a beat every time I come around you. No wonder no one understands. Now I'm going to do mascara and I'm using the Maybelline the Colossal Big Shot mascara. And let's go. So this is the ColourPop highlighter in the shade Smoke and Whistles and it's a super shock cheek and it's in the pearlized finish. So the lipstick that I'm using today is from Lime Crime, and it's in the shade Cement, so from the title of the name, I'm assuming you guys already know it's like a gray color. So it's a bit daring, you don't have to go for this, but I've got it, so I'm going to use it. Alright, so now taking my Fix Plus, I'm going to be spritzing my face. So this is the finishing look. So I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you like this look. Don't forget to subscribe down below because it's free. It's free. And comment any opinions you have or like any questions or anything because I like reading comments and answering the comments and loving comments. <laughs> so yeah, thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.